The Arboretum started off as just an update of a 1995 tree walk. The last one had about 18 locations and it talked about the 18 trees, but ours is more interdisciplinary. So we wanted to do something where each location and not only had a focused tree, but also it talked about the multiple trees around it. I think it's important to learn about trees just because everyone is connected. Whether you realize it or not, everyone has their own story and most memories are even related to trees. This tree here is called a ginkgo and it's known as a, a living fossil and it was coined by Charles Darwin who um, said that living fossils are things that haven't changed over a, a period of time. These trees that you see here are the same trees that you could see hundreds of years ago. The Arboretum started off as a pamphlet and it's evolved using websites and mobile sites and QR codes that's more easily accessible to a lot of different people. So all you have to use is your, your smartphone to then access the QR code and it'll bring up the mobile website. The website will really allow the Arboretum to grow as the trees grow. Agnes Scott has really helped me focus on my interest in sustainability and also helping others learn more about sustainability. Whatever your passion is, you can always relate sustainability back into that.